Hello and welcome, my name is Ryan, I'm also known as RM2K Dev. Welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV Online, A Realm Reborn. We're here with Stelwin. Stelwin from the Steve Fard Bor I can't even remember what it's called now. Ah, Devi, the aura of confidence tells me you've not been idle since we last met. No, that's correct, I have not. I hope you, I hope, I hope I've read you all right for a task that requires the attention of a capable adventurer. Mind that adventurer be you? Sorry, might that adventurer be you? Yes, it will be. Uh, Summerford Farms, that's the one. Oh, a bit of a cutscene. Good to hear. Then I shall lay before you the story tale. You will have heard rumors of the abductions. I citizens have been disappearing from every corner of Limsa Liminsa, as if plucked from the face of the, of, hey, Hydalian, 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 Hydalian boots and all by unseen hand. And what's this got to do with Summerford Farms, you might ask? Well, that remains to be seen, but it seems a collection of right unsavory fellows with azure tattooed faces have been creeping up to the edge of the fields and spying on my human. Now, I doubt anyone would be scrutinized by such savages at the best of times, but the farmlands are convinced that they're the kidnappers of rumor. Oh, kidnappers of rumor. Come for their hides. Yep. Needless to say, they're beside themselves with worry and their work suffering for it, which is the very last thing I need when me, well, when my crewmen, when my old crewmen are still getting used to their new jobs. There's a struggle to get them to leave the farmhouse of a morning. That is, as they say, when you come in, uh, would you be willing to investigate these tattooed thugs for me? Nod. Good lass. The sooner we get to the bottom of this, the sooner the... The sooner this place will start to resemble a working farm again. I suggest you begin by having a look around the Seasong Grotto. If reports are to be believed, our unwelcome visitors have occupied the place. Okay, sounds sounds like a plan. Let's do this. I'm going to call you One-Eyed. I can't remember what his name was now. One-Eyed Stalwin. Oh, I should have taken that quest as well. Oh, door. What's in here? What is in here? Oh wow. Nothing, nothing in particular. Who are you? Tis a pirate. Anyway, let's go. I don't want to waste time. You don't want to waste time. Let's not waste time. We've got some good gear on. Let's go find these. You know what? Let's see if there's anything better, actually. No, there isn't. I'm only level five. What am I doing? The Sea Song Grotto. There it is, just over here. If I head in this direction. We should see it soon. Beautiful game, this one. It has pretty nice environments, I must say. Nice view distance. Lots of stuff in the backgrounds. Of course, tiny mandra mandragoras. Oh, they're pretty cute. Don't really know what they are uh, supposed to be, but they're there. Anyway, Season Grotto is this way. Pook Hatchling. You discovered a new location. All right, what's going on at the Sea Song Grotto? Let's have a look. Uh, of course, tis a cave. They got some boggies. I don't know what they are. They're level seven. Boggy. All right. The stone monument. Let's have a look what this does. You are about to enter an instance battle. Instance battles only occur during certain quests and missions. Take a moment to read the information displayed in the active help window before answering the call of duty. Okay. Duty calls. Commence battle for lurkers in the grotto. Proceed. Oh, oh we're loading into a new instance. I get it. It's an instance quest. Oh my god, it's voice acted. わたしは
船乗りたちの鎮魂かよ。海で生まれて海で死ぬリムサロミンサに生きる民の生き様ね海に帰ることができた船乗りには海難事故が起きぬように祈りを大地に散った船乗りには彼らの魂が海へ戻るための祈りをあなた最近サマーフォード賞に出入りしている冒険者ね噂の人さらいを追ってたんだけど外れだったかしら案外当たりだったのかも。ここのエーテルの乱れは人為的なものだったのね人さらいを追う者がここに2人それを襲う魔物この件口封じを従っているのは一体誰なのかしらさあやっつけるわよあなたと私の2人で。Alright, battle's on! Looks to be the first amount of action we've seen in this game yet. It's like seven episodes in. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, let's do it. Hopefully, that thing. Holy shit, that. I'm literally doing hardly any damage to that thing. Is there anything we can be doing better? Oh no, we're doing alright. Just keep the dots up. Back off. Standard、uh, MMORPG. Not very exciting, I gotta say. Not super.、Um, super exciting. We're just gonna stand here and. And press the button. Ah, here we go. Now we're, now we're in some trouble. Focus on the battle, leave Kenny to the wounds to me. Okay then. Lady, I'm about to die. You better heal me. Okay, she did. She did. I'll trust her now. Keep my dots up. Dots on this guy. Oh my god, is that another one at the door? Oh my god, two more of them! Holy shit! Mayhap we are overmatched. Yeah, no shit! No shit, lady. Oh my god, she said she was gonna keep me healed. Three deaths later. And let's do it. I'll、well, try maybe this time to stand further back. Right, this is a level five quest. We must be able to do it. Gotta be possible. Look at this potion on number four. If I feel myself getting in danger, I'll take the potion. Let's get another bio up on that. There we go. 
Okay, here come the bogeys. Can we get a head start on them? Yes, we can. Right, so these are only level 5 bogeys. Maybe that's the go. Maybe what we'll do this time is we'll take those bogeys out first. That's better. I think we're going to do better this time. I'll focus on the bogeys first. In the second wave, there comes two of the small versions of him and two bogeys. Let's heal up using Psychic. Back to full health. Uh, two guys should appear here. There they are. Get a head start on them. There we go. They've both got Bio. Let's back out of here. There we go. Now we can focus on the bogeys. There we go. Focus on them. Let's try that out. We take away as many of the bogeys as we can. They won't attack us so hard because there'll be less attacks. That's my theory. Let's run. We've got a good health boost there. Go, let's take this bogey. Keep an eye on the health. Can we do it? I hope we can do it. The health is low. Let's go. Alright, we're healed. Go. Back to the bogey. Take that bogey down. There it goes. Let's drop a... One of them. What do you call it? I can't even remember the name of it now. A bio. Oh my god. It's the most intense match ever. Come on, heal me up, lady. There we go. Come on, I need some health. You gotta heal me. There we go. I think we've got it this time. Just playing a little bit smarter. That's one down. Take the next one down. Get a bio on him. Back off a bit. Alright, we got him. Oh, that wasn't so hard. It was just a matter of playing a bit smarter. Go for those weaker bogeys and hopefully, you know, um, you've reduced the amount of simultaneous attacks. Anyways, a cutscene coming up, so I'll shut up now. We'll have a look what they have to say.星の星の秩序を保っていた事は乱れ世界は今闇で道をとしています闇は全てを蝕み、
光のクリスタルは闇を払う光世界をめぐり光のクリスタルを手に入れるのです気がついたやはりこの子無理やりにけしかけられたようね<音声>グーブーの背中にこれが刺さっていたわこのナイフロープを扱う船乗りたちが使うものよどうやらこの剣船乗りそれも海賊たちが絡んでいるのは確かなようねところであなた大丈夫エーテルにでも酔ったのかしら戦闘の後急に倒れたから驚いたわえ大きなクリスタル一体何の話をこれは思わぬ収穫もあったものねなん私はもう少しこの剣を追ってみるつもりあなたは依頼主に注意を促しなさいこれを見せて海賊らしきものが暗躍しているとねこれから忙しくなりそうだわクリスタルの光が重なるときまた会いましょう。All right, that was awesome.、Uh, fantastic cutscene there. Really good voice acting.、Uh, that's why I was told, well, I wasn't told, I read on the forums that, you know, if you play the game with Japanese voices, the voice acting is significantly better. And I have to say, it was. That was some pretty good voice acting.、Um, Pretty good cutscene,、uh, really nice graphics as well. I've got to say, I haven't seen an MMRPG. I mean, I've seen a lot of MMRPGs, you know, with nice, fancy graphics, and this isn't the best graphics. I mean, it's not like hyper realistic or anything, but they look good. And the cutscene, you know, it, um, in the cutscene moments where the camera gets a little bit higher quality and the shaders and the, the game's rendering engine kicks in and starts to make things a little nicer, it actually looks really good.、I'm、getting a solid 60 frames per second as well, pretty much everywhere. Doesn't matter how many things are on the screen at any time, I'm getting. What's my, what's my setting say? 75 frames per second. So, well above the 60 refresh my monitor has, which is good news.、Uh, let's head back. We're going to deliver this quest in and、uh, hopefully claim our victory. Where are we going? I think the dude was up here, wasn't he? There he is. Stale word. Good old stale win. Devi, right am I glad to see you safely returned. My lads were gabbing, <laughs> gabbing around here in what sounded like all seven hells breaking loose near the grotto, and I feared I'd sent you to your death. No. 
If you're in the middle of that commotion, I hope it yielded something of interest. I'd hate to see you risk your life for naught. Right, let's hand over this uh, blunt sailor's knife. Dum dum dum. Hmm, a blade pulled from the back of a creature you slew at the cave, eh? I, I'd agree that such a knife would be part of any seafaring man's kit. I'm starting to think these ruffian pirates come to lure my farmhands back to a life of plunder. Chances are they didn't take kindly to your appearance on their doorstep and sent a maddened goo-boo on you. Is it a goob? A goob-boo? A goo-boo? I don't know how to read that. Alright, the pirates have been adding their numbers lately. I've best warn, oh, I'd best warn the lads and lasses in my employ to be on guard against their schemes. Alright, the schemes, the schemes. Scheming pirates. Hmm, you met someone else at the grotto. A woman with a strange contraption, eh? Ah, Yashtola. Yashtola. She's been in Limsa Laminsa for a good while now. Her studies on the Aether often bring out, often bring her out to Summerford, so her presence at the grotto is hardly unusual. She's an odd-looking lass, I grant you, but she's not the kind to associate with kidnappers. You may take my word for that. All right, then. Well, trust should be... Ah, uh, where trust should be... Lacking, it's in those yeomen of mine who've yet to wholly relinquish their pirate pasts. The temptation to return to the free and easy life of a buccaneer may prove too strong to resist. You have my thanks, Devi. If it weren't for the efforts of Stalewood Adventures like yourself, this farm would be in a far worse state than it is. Just keep on leading your talents in those... Sorry, just keep on lending your talents to those in need, eh? Help bring Limsa to, her bright, to the brighter future she deserves. All right, what do we get? We've got potions and aether. Uh, what do I do? Do I just click complete? Oh, no, I have to pick between a potion or ether. What's the diff? What's the go? 28 MP, 32% health. Obviously, health. Health is going to be my um, bottleneck until I get a little bit stronger at this. Uh, a little bit stronger. And quite frankly, I've realized that my character is way, way too underleveled to be doing these quests. So we're going to need to do some grinding. Typical Final Fantasy style. Grinding is required. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed these videos. Um, sorry for dying like five million times. I'll try and edit that out. <laughs> Make it a little bit less uh, hard to watch. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Then you'll get notified when I upload new videos. And also check out my other channel. It's RM2K Dev. This is RM2K Dev Net Gaming. This channel that you're watching this on right now. RM2K Dev focuses on teaching people how to make games. So if you're interested in that, go subscribe over there. Don't forget to subscribe here. Don't forget to like, leave comments, questions, feedback, suggestions in the description below. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye for now.